we are going to, our cleanup hitter today is Chris Holmes. So Chris, you're up with Joe. Thank you. Yeah, Joe, it's been Thanks. great to, uh, to hear all of your stories and um, all of the questions and answers. But my question is a little different than some of the other questions asked is, um, as somebody who's you know, a low man on the totem pole, it feels like they have a lot of ideas. <laughs> um, <laughs> how would you advise an individual contributor or someone who doesn't necessarily have the decision-making power within a company, but feels like they have ideas to get strategic buy-in from those that can, can make that happen? Um, what would be your advice? Well, I don't know which company you're working for, but anybody at the top should listen. I mean, that's, that's, that's their job. People, people operating and running a company are not the ones who have the ideas. <clears throat> They're the ones who can help those ideas go through because you know, all the ideas in Reba, I don't say all of them, I, I must admit that I designed certain things which are still around today, the road star and stuff like that. Um, but you, you can't do everything yourself, so you must. People in the operation <clears throat> have got to look down, in fact, come down, join, join the people and say, you know, invite a lot of ideas and if uh, you know there's two things if people are not listening one it's the wrong company that you're in the other one is try and do it yourself put your ideas out there there's a lot of a lot of things out there today that you can you can reach out to there's a lot of uh, uh, people who can give you advice can help you uh, can uh, bring the money but you need people who will listen to you uh, otherwise you're, you're, you know, you're banging on a on a door which is uh, it's empty inside you must find the people and do you work for a larger company um it's not super large about 700 people i'm sorry that was oh we have about 700 folks oh, that's okay and nobody's listening um i wouldn't say nobody's listening i'm pretty persistent so. <laughs> <laughs> you just got to keep on persisting then I say, otherwise, uh, go somewhere else. You know, there's lots of places to go and lots of people will uh, will listen to you. It's just keep, and when you say keep persisting, that's what I did to get into America. During me 11 years, I kept going. Resilience, you just got to keep going. And if you keep pushing along enough, you'll get there. Thanks for that, Joe. Joe, I 